Hello again and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. We are in a place that we really have no business being. Uh, this appears to be some high-ranking Arasaka's residence, perhaps. And I want to guess that this is probably going to be where maybe... I'm just going to guess one of the final battles in the game will take place here, or one of the final uh, jobs that we have to do will take place here. Uh, but we have no business being here right now, so we're just going to go ahead and leave. And uh, we need to wait a day for Nancy's call. So we need to find something to do, or we just need to pass time. Uh, as far as finding something to do, there's like an assault in progress over here that I guess we could go to. Um, so let's see if we can't just walk over there and take care of that. We need to get out of here first. Boy, that fence is tall, man. But, um, it's no problem for us, because we can jump super high, man. Man, that was a super high jump, right? But let's go over here and do this thing. Just to pass the time. I mean, it's 6.02 a.m. I'm supposed to wait a day for Nancy's call. I don't know exactly how long we have to wait. Oh, neat, neat tunnel here. Where does this take us? This will take us back into town, it looks like. I want to go in the exact opposite direction. Whoa! <laughs> it's not a very uh, walking friendly city. I mean, yeah, there's kind of like a sidewalk here, but put these street lights right on the middle of the sidewalk, so you have to step out into the street every time you get to where the street lamp is. It's kind of dumb. And there's quite a bit of traffic here. Really cool cars up here, though. Alright, let's go up here and see what assault is taking place. We'll just play the cops. Okay. Let's neutralize the perps and secure Lock evidence. If you're willing to fix my back, I'm in. Yeah, exactly. In the name of science. If you're willing to fix my back, I'm in. Yeah, in the name of science? These are Arasaka dudes. What is going on over here? I don't know, man. I mean, is Arasaka, like, beating up on people? Hmm. There's a dude kind of kneeling down over there. I see four dudes. Well, one of them's a net runner. Neutralize the perps and secure evidence. I mean, oh god, it! Why is this? Somehow my weapons keep getting taken out of their slots. Why is this weapon out of its slot? I don't know. Overwatch belongs in that slot, so we're gonna put it back in that slot, and we're gonna take out this. Okay, this is the guy that they must be shaken down here, Trenton Robertson. The problem is, is that. They're probably going to kill him when I do this. And I'm really sorry about that, Trenton, but there's not really a whole lot I could do about it. Um, what I wish I had now is... The only example I could think of it is... Um, uh, I think in the Max Payne games, I don't remember what it was called. I don't know if it was called Bullet Time or what, but you could just, like slow down time and then like, boom, shoot this guy, and then boom, shoot this guy uh, real fast. And I wish that you could do that in uh, this game. I don't believe he deserves a raise. But he ain't trustworthy. But did you hear who he fought for in the wars? Huh? Exactly. I mean, as far as I know, there is no way to slow down time in this game. What's interesting is that he doesn't have full health. Oh, no, it's his health is really varying. I'm not sure what's up with that. But we're going to go ahead and take him out mm -hmm. just because he's a net runner and he's going to be problems anyway. And then I'm going to try to take this guy out afterwards, but I don't think it's going to work. The, yeah, okay. <laughs> Dude's honking his horn at me. Are right, you ready for this? We're being attacked! Uh, okay, he let that guy live. Go, go, go! He's down. 
And this guy here, he had like something weird on his face. Did you see him? His face looks weird. And they're all down. <laughs> and the perps are neutralized. We now need to secure evidence. Even though I was basically helping the cops out here, I was still doing illegal activity. So hopefully the cops won't show up here and uh, give me grief. Let's see what was going on over here. What's on the ground? We've got a weapon. Uh, bounce back. So yeah, what's up with this guy's face? Check it out. Interesting. He is definitely Arasaka. Got this cool vehicle here. I could get in if I wanted to. Arasaka Ultralight Hybrid Tactical Harness. Sounds cool. Another hybrid tactical harness. Where's y'all's weapons? Here's, here they are. Here they are. They're both lying right here. A Nikamata and a Copperhead. And something else laying on the ground there. I don't know what it is. Can't seem to pick it up or interact with it. Ooh, reinforced office shoes. Kangtel Manganese Combat Ocu Set. And target for liquidation. Name Diana Kuno. Status red, priority highest. Signed Dr. Joanne Koch. Huh, interesting. Um. Well, unfortunately. She did not survive. Dress, a kunai, bunch. What in the world? Look how many euro dollars. One thousand or ten thousand sixty-two. Oh my gosh! And an archived conversation between Diana Kuno and Wakako. What? Diana, I need your help. Something's up at Biotechnica. The research I was working on with Koch has was leaked. Higher ups want to pin it on me. All the casualties, everything. Meanwhile, all of them, Koch included, pretend they knew nothing about it, walk away clean. And that's not all. They're going to kill me so the prosecutor can't question me. I know, because I've done this before myself. I need help getting out of town. Today, cost isn't an issue. Wakaka writes back and says, my answer is no. You are up to your neck in shit, and I won't dirty my hands pulling you out of it. But let me give you some advice. If you want to get out of Night City, do it now. This second, now. Damn, Wakako. Well, she didn't make it. I don't know if I could have saved her or not. But from over there, when I was peeping through my viewfinder, my sniper weapon, I saw somebody here being held at gunpoint, but it was it was a, a man. It looked like to me, because I zoomed in on him, and it was a dude's name. So I don't know, man. I don't know. I think this had already gone down before I got here. Nothing we could do about it, unfortunately. What's done is done. Well, that took a whole 30-some minutes. I still have to wait a day. Looks like they're uh, working on building a tunnel here. That's pretty neat. But I can't get in there. If we look at the map... Yeah, we'll see this tunnel going off here. It looks like a tunnel heading to Arasaka headquarters over here. Over here, we've got some suspected crime activity. Let's go check it out, man. I don't know. Let's just do some, some, some things on this side of the map. Why not? Why the heck not? Let's, uh, let's take one of these cool vehicles. They're not going to be using them. I'm going to unmark these guys just to get them off my map. Huh, skull there. I guess that's where we're going, huh? Yeah, okay. Let's uh, let's take one of these vehicles for a ride. Belongs to me now. Uh, door's open. Hold on, I gotta shut that door. Can't drive around with the door open, jeez. Okay. Let's go down the road here. 
Let's see what's going on. There's my other vehicle over there, the Delamain vehicle. But hey, I have an opportunity to drive this Arasaka vehicle. Why not? Why not drive it? I'm just taking it easy. I don't want to arise any suspicion. Some kind of steam coming up there. place. Impala Automatics. Oh boy. These guys. Ooh. What's this? NCPD Dispatcher. Calling all NCPD subcons. APB out for suspected organized crime activity over on Sycamore Street. Due to non-payment of rent and related fees, Night City has terminated its lease agreement with Impala Automatics for industrial property owned by the city. Impala Automatics has failed to comply with the decision and now illegally occupies the premises specified in the contract. City authorities have offered a reward for the successful eviction of Impala Automatics. Hmm. I wonder what an eviction looks like. Like, if I knock everybody out, does that count? Hey, there's a dead body right here. The hell? Can't scan it. I hate it when I can't scan them. There's another one over there. Did, I, did these guys do this? These peeps? Well, let's start marking people. Oh, it's a freaking robot. Uh, why can't I mark the robots? Because I was doing it wrong. There's a camera up here. Let's uh, take control of the camera. All right, we got a robot. We got dead bodies here. I guess the robots did it. Always blaming it on the robots. Uh, there's one walking there. Let's mark him. Oh, it's a. This one's a dude. Just a generic worker. What else we got? Let's move over to the next camera. You see any more movement? Any more robots or people? I don't. Huh. Okay, we'll go to this camera now. There's somebody. Mark him. Got another robot. Hmm. What's the best way for me to take out robots? I'm not sure. We got a guy over here. These guys are just workers. But, according to the city, they're here illegally. Should have vacated the premises, and they did not, so... Everything is fair game? Lots of cameras. Let's do a ping on this guy and see if he has any friends. Alright, okay, we see this guy show up here. That's about it. This guy's already marked. Oh. What's this? We got a laser thing here. Don't think I could do anything about it from here. Forklift. Can't quite get to the laser thing. Maybe another camera. Uh-huh. Here we go. We're going to turn this off. Distract enemies, initiate overload. Put it on friendly mode. 
Um, boy, this this thing would kill people, man. Right? Huh. I don't know, man. I don't know if I feel right about killing workers just hanging out here. We'll just turn this off. Ooh, a laptop. Take control. Oh. I forget that all this really does is let me look through its, um... Camera. I always wish that I could actually read what's on it. Wasn't quite done. Yeah, this guy got unmarked somehow. Alright. Uh, let's go back to the last camera we were at, which I think was this one. Okay, I'll mark this guy. So there's a lot more robots here than I initially thought. Make sure there's nobody up there. A camera here. Here we go. Let's turn this thing off. Oh, no. Not the crane. The turret. I'm going to turn it off. I always look so sad when I turn it off. It's like, mm, now I'm depressed. Huh, that was interesting. It's like there was something inside of this thing before it finished drawing itself. Alright, now we're back to the first camera. I know there's one more turret somewhere over here. I feel like it's over in that direction. And I'm thinking that I'm not going to be able to get to it. The turret is somewhere over there. And that camera right there is about as close as I'm going to be able to get to it, but this stupid forklift is in the way. Right there. Can I do anything with the... Nah. I can use it to distract enemies. But that doesn't help me get to the turret. Can't get around it, so eh, he's gonna go check it out. Well, um, secure the area. Use of force permitted. Let's start taking out robots. Okay, he's down. Is anybody aware? How come he's not marked? Where'd he go? Okay, now he's marked. He's walking over there. Good God. <laughs> this is the best weapon ever. It is so great. He's down. Nobody seems to care. This is cool. Thought for sure that the robots would be communicating with each other. But no. They don't seem to be. So we're just going to mosey on over here. And start taking these guys out one by one. My new favorite way to take peeps out is with my weapon that shoots through walls. Can I get on top of this building? I don't know if I can, man. That's pretty high up. Be cool if I could. Hmm. Can I go on top of this fence? No. Well, maybe I can from here. Oh, I didn't want to jump over the fence, doggone it. Well, that'll work, I guess. Turn this camera off. Uh, what is, oh crap. Did not see him before. Did I mark him or not? Wyvern drone. 
He's down. <laughs> Nobody hears this happening. <laughs> it's just so much fun, man. Oh my god. <laughs> this is awesome. This is the best. Still none of them any the wiser that this is happening. Nobody knows what's going on. Can't believe it. I do know there's more cameras. Right? I thought there was another camera on this wall here, but... Maybe not. I'm trying to find the other cameras before I lose track of them and then they spot me. There's one. I thought I just saw one. I thought I saw one. Let's see if getting on top of this building buys us anything. Whoa. Okay, there's that guy. I could have swore I marked him already. Now he's marked. Well, they might notice this. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, my gosh. Oh, so great. I thought there was somebody over here in this area. Maybe even in the building I'm on top of. But I don't see anything marked. Well, how come... You know what? I think that I, when I went back over there... When I was back over here by the truck, I think I backed away a little bit. And then came back. And I think when that happened, everything that I marked became unmarked, maybe? Because these dudes aren't marked anymore. Come on, zoom in, dude. Zoom in, camera. What are you doing? Why can't I zoom in all of a sudden? This might be a problem. The robot might see this happen. But I'm having too much fun. Robot don't care. Robot don't care. Why the heck can't I zoom in? It's like my zoom only goes this far now. I don't understand. My zoom used to be so much further. What happened to my zoom? This is bizarre how quiet this is. I mean, you know somebody's standing right around right around there. Man, where'd that camera go that was over there too? I don't know. Here we've got something we could connect to. Do one C nope, I can't get to seven A. Huh. One C seven A five five B D. Got them all, man. Got them all. It's a good day. What is this? A fan? Can't quite get underneath it there. We know there's more robots around here. I don't know why I picked that up. I thought it was going to be something better than surgical scissors. I 
It's so quiet. I feel like I should be I should be able to hear my own footsteps as I'm crouching around here, you know. I don't like that I'm making absolutely no sound. I mean, no sound coming from that. I feel like there's just still some little bugs in the game that just were never fixed. I told you, I think in the last episode, that patch 1.23 has been applied. And I read what it fixed, and I really didn't see anything, you know, that I felt like needed to be fixed. They're just like things specific to, to gigs. But um, I didn't see anything where I was like, oh, cool, they fixed that. What is... Oh, okay. I thought I saw something up there. Where did the rest of these robots go, man? Something's over there. That's just a regular old residence. But then over on the right, it says it's a robot. Man, I tell you what. What's this right here? Oh, this is, um... Wait a minute, there's somebody here. Did you see him? That's just a, uh... Whoops. Security turret that... Well, turn off. Okay. Yeah, I think all that work I did with the cameras was negated when I stepped a little bit too far away. What is he doing? Oh, damn it. Huh, okay, my engineering just went up. <laughs> this is fun. Look at how that guy landed. What do you got, anything good? A burrito. He's gonna get some food on him. Speaking of which, I'm I mean, I'm in a hostile environment, but nothing says that I can't help myself to some food. Get my health rejuvenating. So there's a dude way over there. I think I'm too far away from him to try to shoot him from here. Secure the area. That is a turret that is shut off, I believe. I wish I could loot this guy. Get some parts off of him. Need to stop. There you go. I leveled up. Still haven't completely secured the area though. Whoa. Oh, these damn drones. Okay, don't have to worry about him anymore. I think I hear another one flitting around. Whoa. Look at him scanning it. You are instructed to reveal yourself. Well, there's your sound effects. He was very loud. Pretty sure I hear another drone. You are instructed to reveal yourself. There's a weapon here. Yeah, I mean, these are the kinds of things that I want to see him fix. I could see, I could plainly see the weapon there, but I can't, I can't loot it. Oh, good thing I picked that up. Hmm, well, what else do we have left? What was that? What is making that noise? Oh my. Oh my. I don't know what it is, but I'm scared. Activated device? What? Oh, 
Oh my. There's a dude there. He's gonna go over and check it out. He walks very strangely. Creepily so. He's got Arasaka on his back. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> and you can see on my mini-map, there's still something else in here. Oh my. What is this thing? Militech mech? Can I take it out? Okay. Okay. No idea how much damage I need to do to this thing. Oh, you're just gonna stand right- Oh, fucking to my right! Oh, crap. Comes the mech. Oh, something else to my- Something to my left now. Oh, hell, I missed. Whoops. Alright. Well, he was moving. Whoa, something else. A person yelling or something. Where's the best place to hit this thing? Hmm. What can I do to this thing? Who's making that noise? Somebody controlling the mech? Oh, okay, he has a health bar now. He's down. That's it. That was the last thing I needed to... to oh, there's a dude right there. I was like... Remember earlier in the game when somebody ran up to me with a knife and killed me? I was like, oh my god, after all this, this guy's gonna kill me with a knife. Well... There you have it. We've cleared this place out. He's gonna hit me with a monkey wrench. Uh, crafting. Here's an archive conversation between Lamar and Dr. Koch. Lamar, Dr. Koch, it's urgent. Someone attempted to hack our servers today. They were looking for data on your project. Please exercise the utmost caution. I've already put in the request to double your security and informed all regional offices and units. Dr. Koch says, noted, thanks. Thanks, man, appreciate it. Not real sure what these guys are doing. That's a little disturbing. Look at this guy. You alright there, buddy? Huh? You alright? You okay? <laughs> Smile for the camera. <laughs> well, I may as well go ahead and walk around here and loot this place. See what's up. See if there's anything good here. Still considered a hostile area, even though I've cleared everybody out. At least I think I've cleared everybody out. Game kind of acted like it really only wanted me to take out that mech. Ooh, the red room. What's in here? Some kind of armor. Ooh, force this open. All right. Interesting looking room. Get ourselves a max dock here. Meat Man Strikes Again. I think I remember reading that earlier in the game. It seems the killer known as Meat Man has claimed yet another life. His fourth by our count. Meat Man. That's kind of gross. Ooh. Oh. Okay, never mind. 
thought I saw the word conversation. But there was not the word conversation. Get another bounce back. That's neat. Not sure what that is. Some kind of server tower, maybe? I don't know. Pretty cool looking. I like it. Get ourselves a little bit of rifle ammo, why not? Alright, let's walk around out here. See if anybody else is left alive. This is that weapon that I couldn't loot before. Be careful, these turrets might still be live out here. I'm pretty sure there's at least one turret over here. There's one right there. And I think I hear a camera. Yeah, there's a camera. Go ahead and turn it off. Looks like we could get on top of this building. Pretty cool. Neat view of the city from here. I like it. Whoa. Really? Really? I'm having a relic manufacture man man you what's the word I'm looking for? Malfunction? stick that was strange that just that just kind of happened randomly I always felt like the uh, relic malfunctions kind of take place at certain points in the game certain story points but that one just felt completely random I don't know if you know if you saw it but something showed up at the top of my screen too maybe it always shows up when the relic malfunctions here's an urgent message to all units our net runners have detected suspicious activity in the company net. Someone's scanning the ports and looking for an entry point. The signal strength suggests the attacker is close. Please keep on high alert. Let's see if there's anything cool in this uh, computer here. A couple of messages. Uh, from Night City Hall to Impala Automatics. We kindly inform you that the Night City Landlord's Authority has enacted a temporary moratorium on eviction of properties occupied by Impala Automatics, Inc. In accordance with the court ruling dated 09-27-2076, we hereby demand that the CEO of Impala Automatics, Luan Mathembu, pay a grand total of $48 million in rent arrears. The above sum must be paid within two days of receiving this letter. If this requirement is not met, the NCLA will enforce their rights to the maximum extent permitted by law. And then it says it's over from a deleted account to another deleted account. They finally found out and cut off our financing. We're fucked. There's nothing we can do? No ace up our sleeves? No, we just have to wrap it all up. Okay, but as long as we're still operational and nobody barges in here toting iron, why not just keep things running? Makes no difference to me, just destroy any evidence, anything that could have left a trail to us. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. What you got? Some cool stuff. Oh, here's another cool vehicle right here. Oh, I could drive this one too. Cool. Um, can we get in this building here? Oh, boo. We cannot. That's no fun. Now, didn't I just loot this guy? Why does he still have that icon over top of him? This is where that other turret was, and it's even still operational. Camera! Intruder detected. Enemies have been alerted. Oh, yeah? Well, come on, come out, come out wherever you are, enemies. If somebody sees me, come get me, mofo. Uh-oh. 
I think I'm just about ready to get shot at. Stupid forklift in my way. Somehow that turret can see me, but... Oh, oh, not forklift. Oh, it's tricky. There we go. Take care of that jerk. Can I get into the building from this way? No. Well, that's a bunch of crap. Just because. Just because I can. Whoa. Combat? With who? Combat? Who am I fighting with? Combat. Whoa. Who, where, what? Whoa! Who's over here? Somebody is still alive. Whoa, he's right there. <laughs> Did you see him moving across there? One dude, a human, I believe. Aha. Uh -huh. Interesting. Well. Can't save while I'm in combat. I don't want to die now. That would suck. Well, let's see if we can't take this guy out. Where are you? This might be the smartest enemy I've ever faced. Where'd he go? Not that that would blow up. There he is. It's a sniper, too. Missed him. That was terrible. There he goes. Okay, music, you can stop now. Although, I feel like that wasn't the guy that saw me. Right? The music is certainly acting like something else is still going on. Whoa, yeah, there is. <laughs> Anybody else want some of this? Huh? <laughs> Boy, I tell you what, my health was a lot lower than I thought it was. I'm getting all cocky over here. Let's eat some food. Let's eat, um... Orgiatic Omniflav. That sounds great. Just the pick me up you need after knocking out a bunch of bunch of jerks. <laughs> uh, probably can't get into these buildings either, can we? No. Sure can't. Um, I want to drive this vehicle over here. Just for the heck of it. I, I want to see if it's possible to even drive this vehicle out of here. Let's see. It'll be fun. Oh, wait a minute. I haven't looted this guy yet. This guy who's doing some, some yoga pose over here or something. Alright, let's see. You drive this vehicle if I can remember where the heck it was. Here it is. Let's try this. There's still people alive. See him up there? Did you see him? They're up there on top of that building. And then it sounded like there was somebody right to my right here, too. Huh. 
That's hilarious. See? Up there. Game's up, terrorist. Just cut your losses already. Game's up, terrorist. Veteran guard. We're going to ping. Because there were two of them up here. Sounded like the ping was to my left. Ah. He's attacked. Won't <laughs> Surprise! Oh, I didn't kill him. Liquidate him! Oh, crap. There we go. <laughs> Anybody else? <laughs> Gosh, it's so much fun. That is the coolest weapon. I just don't know why you would ever want a different weapon. It is so badass. Now I'm over encumbered. I was waiting for that to happen. Well, hopefully nobody's left and hopefully nobody will attack me now because I need to take care of some of my weaponry. Look at that cool jacket we're wearing. I hadn't gotten a good look at it before. It's pretty cool, right? Well, let us, um, you know, disassemble some of these, uh, weapons here. And, uh, we'll sort by quality. And this is just a regular old common. And we'll just dismantle these things. These very common weapons, even the uncommons. I don't care about these. I haven't really felt like there's a, a compelling reason to um, upgrade anything, really. I mean, like crafting? I don't know. Is it is it worth it? Uh, crafting upgrades. I love, love, love this weapon. And um, I could upgrade it so that it does even more damage. So why not? Okay. And uh, apparently I could upgrade it even further. And um, I could upgrade it even further. And um, I don't see myself ever getting rid of this weapon, so let's upgrade it even more. And uh, what level is the weapon? Where does it tell me what level the weapon currently is? Because I don't think you could upgrade your weapon to a higher level than you currently are. But I don't see where it tells me what level the weapon is. I mean, as long as I've got... Ah, components. Now I've run out of rare item components, so I can't upgrade that anymore. And, you know, I guess maybe... Like my clothing, some of the stuff that I'm wearing. Um, what am, what do I actually have equipped right now? I'm sure there's some, will there be some kind of indicator telling me what I have equipped? Doesn't look like it. Can I not upgrade something that I'm currently wearing? What do these ones in red mean? Insufficient components. Okay, so this might be what I'm wearing. Yeah, the, I don't know. I don't know how to tell what I'm wearing. But anyway, I probably can upgrade my clothing as well. I should probably stop and do that every now and again. New item received. I don't want a new item. Alright. Well, that'll do it for this episode. Next episode, we'll probably just go ahead and, and, and wait. Um... I think there's a, a way you could just simply wait in this game, right? Skip time. I'll probably do that. Uh, waiting for Nancy's call. I don't know. We'll see what kind of mood I'm in the next episode. <laughs> Although I will say that I actually ended up having fun doing these uh, two little quests here in this episode. And I hope you had fun too. If you did, why don't you let me know? Leave me a like or a comment. Thanks for watching. I hope you join me again in the next episode.